Marco Chicho, if you were a 21-year-old university student living in Canada, what would you do to set your, yourself up for what's to come? <laughs> Silver links. What would I do if I was 21? Um, uh, precious metals are important. Uh, I would make sure I'm well. Miss Balloon Hands, how you doing? Hope you're doing well. Uh, I would make sure I'm educated in tech. I would make sure I'm on using social platforms that have encryption, right? So I would not, I, if I was 21 years old, I would not be on Facebook. I would not be on Instagram. I would not be on Reddit with my real link to everything. I would not be on uh, Twitter with my real name or anything like this. I would not be on any of the main platforms, okay, with anything associated to me directly, including Gmail. I would go through Proton Mail or one of the other, um, what do you call it, uh, encrypted email services, right? So if I was 21, I would make sure that I had my anonymity in place and my privacy in place. That is ridiculously important. Ridiculously important. Really. I'm I'm out. If you want to think about it that way, right? I'm out. All right? There's a lot of things linking me to who I am. Not, uh, not in ways that... I'm on the radar, but I am, but it's hard to link me up because I decentralized my data, right? I don't have my name and finances and all that jazz linked up to everything, right? I would be buying buying and selling things in cash only, only, within reason. Some stuff you can't help but eBay and shit like that. But wherever I could, I'd be paying in cash don't use your bank account and visa and mastercard and shit like this because that's linking you up to who you are right so you would make sure if i was 21 was living in the western world or china or, or anywhere right make sure uh you create uh you have privacy with your digital identity right um cryptos are problematic right now because nice bird singing uh problematic right now to a certain degree but whatever right but i would stay uh, with the privacy coins monero and the like instead of bitcoin and ethereum and stuff like this right precious metals i mentioned but precious metals you would have a little bit on the side you would i would dive dive di diversify my income i would for sure make sure i was diversified in my income right so make sure you don't have one central body will, that you depend on to have money coming in i would reduce my expenses and build up my savings okay uh, i would look into local farms and whatnot start buying eating healthy eat eating healthy extremely important extremely important i would not get any boom booms uh, i would meditate stay physically fit okay um what else what else i would read books uh, i would get my news from independent news sources i would not be consuming any corporate political news including the cbc right um, unless you want to see what they're feeding the masses right uh, i would not get married don't lock yourself in uh, but if you're with a partner stay true okay stay true with your partner and uh, make sure you're both on the same page I would grow food if I could as soon as we finish this we're gonna take down some lettuce okay I hope that helps I hope that helps who asked that question uh, who asked that question uh, oh yeah Marco I hope that helps Marco okay and I would definitely not be working for the government do not work for government on any level right 
municipal, local, provincial, federal. No government employ employment. Because at some point, all that funding is going to die off and your job is going to be cut. Especially since you're 21, because it's all about seniority. It's not about who you are, what you can do or anything, right? Uh, prove yourself. Work hard. Make sure that you're hooked up with people that you respect and they respect you back, right? Because when the time comes, they will turn to you and you can turn to them. Okay. Brad Chicho, are we uh, need is our... All we need is our comics and popcorn and enjoy the shit show, Brad. I got lots of lots of that. Lots of that. Marco, well said. I appreciate that, man. It's so hard to stay away from negative shit in this world. Yeah. Marco, there's so much positive going on. I'm about to show you me harvesting lettuce that is absolutely amazing to eat. Like this makes some of the best salad and best cuckoo you ever had, right? And it keeps me healthy, keeps us healthy. Okay.